Hello everybody, Sifter again with a new Legend of Keepers run. And today I'm gonna be going back to the Engineer here at the level 4. And let's go over the talents real quick. We're gonna go straight up for the tra training prices of mechas are cheaper. Uh, this is pretty much useless. Master gains uh, resistance when he was defeated for a trap. That's almost never gonna happen. And mechas generate 10% of the maximum life when attacking. That's also nice. And we will go for the cheaper prices. I mean, what would I go for? This thing? In Kane's armor? <laughs> This thing, I, I don't even know. I don't think she has good talents. I don't really like the engineer in the end of it. Maybe you guys like the engineer? Comment down below whatever you like most. I may even put up a poll. Anyway, let's start the run right away. Let's see how this goes. Uh, I will try to go for a morale run because most of the units are morale based. So let's get the morale Tesla cannon here. And let's start the namings right away. Let's start with our good old... Uh, butters here, our Patreons, if you would also like to have a priority in the name, extra row, uh, come become a Patreon, I guess, Adalus, Kimberley is the Naga here, and the requested Enigmatic Shadow for the Spellcasters, and these are our units, I think I will rotate them over, yeah, I don't, I don't th like them like that, I want to have him back and him front to the front, uh, as resistance go, I I will pretty much get destroyed by anything nature re related, but we will see. So let's go for the mansion first and then the trainer, because I said I will be buying units whenever possible. Uh, what do we get here? 20 morale plus and chance trap to the next trap. Deal 100% damage once. Does this thing work with... Does this thing work with the morale? You know what, let's take the... The Fukiono, Yono, whatever. And let's keep the money for upgrades. I want to go for... Uh, morale related enemies. Also, I want to change the name here first. And... We got Krieger Blue. That should be it for the Patreons. So, let's start the upgrades. Uh, I have run this thing before. And I died like in the third fight or something. Because the enemies had morale regen... And uh, morale whenever you kill an enemy, and <laughs> morale once uh, per dungeon, and I'm pretty much lost. So I know that Enigmatic Shadow is the best choice for upgrades here, so I will go right off and upgrade him. Because from 9 and th 2 demoralized, it's 24 and 3 demoralized to everybody. So as you can see, it's extremely strong for a morale run. Let's go to the collectors, give them some money, and gain the gold. Uh, should I send somebody off to a business trip? I mean, what am I gonna fight here? I'm gonna fight these guys. The level three with the disaster room. So let's go to business trip, get some money. We can send butters, or we can uh, turn it completely around and go full on on DPS build. No, let's send butters. I don't know if this, if these are scripted or whatever. Let's set Krieger Blue to the back and let's go. If these are scripted, then. What should this fight be? I will remember what this fight is going to be if it's scripted. There's no reason for me to lie. Uh, I start to believe this is scripted. Ice to the front and air to the front. Ice and air is going to be... Almost everybody. Let's bring Max Row. And then fire to the back is obviously going to be enigmatic shadow. And Hedos in the middle. Let's go. Uh, Pandora's box to amplify the already many debuffs that the enemies will gonna have are gonna have. Actually, I'm not sure they are scripted because I don't remember this. Uh, I don't remember having advanced trap front in the front ever. Air and ice. Air and ice is gonna be Pierre, and then fire to the back. As I said, the Naga, Kimberley, the Krieger Blue. You help the team out. Let's go. Okay, does anybody have below average air resistance? Obviously not. So I guess let's just go for the morale hit. Uh, does it really matter? Let's spawn the front. I don't care. And let's go, because he has the least morale overall. Let's go for the morale plus haste. The other choice would be to go for the stun maybe. Now let's go for the morale and haste. So that I'm sure that I'm gonna play first. Nice. 
And even more morale. But middle one protected himself. Yeah. My units are gonna survive this. You just exist. <laughs> I'm sorry, Max Rowe. Tank for the team. Tank for the team. Yeah, Frontline's gonna get feared away. Whoop. And Frontline removed all the debuffs from everybody, obviously. Of course, of course. Yep, he's toast. Let's do our best here before we die, because the team's gonna go down for sure. Come on, you can do it. Enigmatic Shadow. Okay, Enigmatic Shadow is gonna survive one more hit. Ah, nice. You did what you were supposed to. Now everybody's gonna die before they even arrive to the end. Yeah. <laughs> you guys aren't going anywhere. Uh, get feared. And bye. Ooh, okay, I guess. And bye. He got even stunned. How did he run away? He was stunned. So, okay, these are new. I didn't have these choices the last time around. Uh, Deep Barrier, Nature and Morale. You know what? I will either go for this because of the stack amplification or for the... Uh, I will go for... Shalan for the armor plus the nature resistance and a little bit of air. The nature resistance is what I care mostly actually about. So let's take this for the nature resistance. Let's go on. We got a hit of two on both my units. Let's go for the trainer. We got 661. Then I will go for the collector. So enigmatic shadow is gonna get power which is gonna amplify this even more and also uh, amplify this and this. I want everything to be as strong as possible because I might need the damage. 90 fire damage that can kill units. I don't need to go full on for morale. And then I want to upgrade Pierre as well. Just because. Oh, wait a second. Maybe I want Kimberley. Yeah, let's go for Kimberley here. She gets 20 power and upgrades one of the better skills. So let's go for that. 18 and a bunch of power. Oh, I got even more money. You know what? I will go for Kruger Blue as well because this skill is gonna get extremely strong. Look at this 10 power and upgrade, and boom, 60. Extremely powerful skill to collector. Why was there a. <laughs> what was the. I, I, I was gonna spend the money anyway. I want to. I think I want to buy another unit because then I'm gonna go to business trip. Yeah, let's go buy some units here. We got Notcher and the roaster I will buy I th I think I'm gonna go for the archer uh, just to have another unit and to have the nature coverage yeah let's get the archer he's 75 he's gonna be worth it I'm gonna send somebody to fetch me some money what do we get here heroes with less than 50% of their maximum morale this 30% world resistance I like this but I don't want to s what do I want to send Hedalus what does Hedalus do ah I can send Hedalus, but he's gonna be gone forever, pretty much. The other choice would be to get 233 and 25 blood. I think this is more worth it in the long run. Although I'm I'm morale focused, and this thing is gonna amplify the damage output, but I... Wait a minute. What am, what am I talking about? I want to amplify my damage output. Yeah, let's go for that. I want to amplify my damage output by a lot. Hedalus, see you around, man. See you around. Do I have everything covered here? Nature, armor, ice, fire. Yeah, I should be covered pretty much. Um, maybe I should bring... Ah, uh, yeah, I think I will bring them to the top. The backline's the, a strong team. I don't think the backline's gonna change at all. Let's go for the artifact and let him have the resting room because I'm mostly morale book focused and let's hope we get something good out of the artifact. I would like to get the the double casting artifact if possible. I don't even know if there are that strong artifacts. Obviously, first trap nothing. Um, the second trap's behind them, so let's go for the spider. What do we get here? We get the reason I went for the spider here is because uh, the double uh, because the spider applies. 
uh, terrified. And then this thing's gonna stack the debuffs and these guys are definitely gonna use debuffs. So what do we got here? We don't got a lot of morale going on, do we now? Physical, nature and air. Air is gonna be this guy. Physical is gonna be this guy or this. Actually physical and nature, so let's place them here. Shlan, Talos in the back and Enigmatic Shadow in the middle. Yeah, Max Row, I don't. I could use Max Row for the Ice Hit. Should I go full on DPS here? Spoken Armor. No, I don't think so because the backline is completely morale focused and this guy is gonna do a morale damage on his own. These two guys can do whatever they want. I also have this thing, so. Those box. Nice, nice, nice. And physical and air, as I said before, air 60%, bye bye, physical 15%, and blade in the middle. Let's go. Let's hope for the best. Yep, you guys got ter terrified. Can I play before the terrified gets removed or what now? Uh, let's apply poison to everybody so that this guy can do his first attack and spread some poison. Uh, wow, look how much demoralization we are doing here. Just because of the terrified. Why did the backline remove the terrified that quickly? You know what? Uh, yeah, you help here with the morale. Let the poison be. You continue spreading them though. Okay, everybody's still alive. Now Mill's behind half. Look at... Minus 95% nature resistance. Well, I won't be able to use it, but... Ooh, almost survived. Almost survived. Obviously, they have morale healing. But I stacked everything up here. Of course, there is normal healing as well. Let's go for the morale attack, I think. Yeah, everything else really not useful. Morale attack. There's a high chance that this trap amplification even gonna survive until they hit this thing over here. Let's try to remove the front line. Actually, uh, who's next? Everybody else gonna attack the back line. Okay, Naga, you got this alone, right? I don't think she got it alone, though. I think I should go to the back line with everybody. Uh, wait a minute, 40 morale and demoralized. Yeah, we got this. This guy's gonna attack everybody. Ooh, she got a stun off. You do the backline. Yeah, you do nothing. You get stunned. Can you demoralize him too? Yeah, let's uh, let's make them leave. Let the backline be. Bye bye, bye bye, and bye bye. Very nice. The backline team is really strong on its own. So monsters place in the front. A 50 speed. But this I like. Mechas gain 20% of maximum life as barrier points when attacking at least one hero whose life is above 30%. This is also nice. Most of a group containing three different types for the power. Ah, this... Uh, I think I only have two types. I only have demons and mechas. So this is... Uh, wait a minute. I have definitely mechas. I have skeletons for sure. Uh, mechas, skeletons. And I think I also have demons. I think I can. I think I can do this thing. So the last fight, the Naga I think is a demon, the, the other unit is also a demon, and the some mecha. And the front team, yeah I think I can do this, I, I think I can do this thing. So, 30% power is pretty strong. Let's try this, I have never tried this, and I think this run it is possible to do this thing. Let me double check that I'm not really stupid. Actually, did I forget to name units? Is Shalan a unit? Wow, I forgot to name units here. So... Serenix is this guy, right? Shalan is not a yeah. Shalan is not the username. So Serenix, welcome to the club. If you would also like to have your names on units, uh, comment down below that you want a name and what name you want. Otherwise, I will just use your YouTube name. And Mike Roch Burns is also part of the team. Did I forget anybody? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I think I did not forget anybody. So these are my units now. This is not yeah. Skeleton. Uh, yeah, skeleton, mecha, and demon, and mecha, demon, demon. 
If I get another skeleton, you know what? Come back here. Help these guys out. I don't think I will not be using all of them. You know what? This guy can help here instead of instead of Maxero being there. He can go to the front. That's what I can do. Uh, let's go off to a uh, trainer, in my opinion. Although the course the course is also always costing 250, and it almost always takes a level two unit, so it's most likely gonna pick either Pierre or Maxero or Serix. Everything. Oh, we have four choices here for the course. Do I want to sell anything in the black market? I think not. Now I will go trainer, event, event. Yeah. 10, 10, 10. This is nice, but... I mean, power. Ooh, this even stronger. And power? Yeah, let's take this. This is gonna be 80 or something. 70. Nice. Uh, let's go to the event. I don't want to sell any units. Uh, gain 15 blood because I need it of course I cannot go event um, I can't even buy him what am I thinking about collectors I I will continue gaining gold from the collectors until I die until one team passes the all my units and I die <laughs> so now is the time for to do what I want to do Battles come to the front so we got the triple team here one two uh, one two three these three units are gonna be the front team and the back team is going to be most likely one. Uh, I will see what I will do with the back team. Maybe I, I will not try to force this artifact. Wait a minute. What's the demon in the front line? Serenix is the front line demon? I can use Kimberly in the front line with his first with the, the first skill. Spamming the first skill. Or even Trigger Blue spamming the first skill. Yeah, I think I can do that. And then it's going to... And there's gonna be one, two, and whatever of those two I pick. And this also have nature coverage. Yeah, bring them but to the front. Krieger blue for the nature coverage. And bring Serenix back for the nature coverage as well. Do I have armor coverage? Yeah, this guy has the armor coverage in case I need him. Yeah, I think we're good to go. There's a high chance that I trigger this 30% power on both fights. Hopefully it won't kill me. <laughs> okay, let's see what we got. Okay, this is definitely not the same as the last time, so there is randomness for sure. Eyes to everybody, nature to everybody, and nature to the front. Wow, good thing I have Krieger Blue here, but I don't think he's gonna survive a lot. We are gonna go down hard, hard and quick. Hard and quick indeed. Uh, enigmatic shadow to the back so that he's the last survivor and butters in the middle 40% nature yeah it's better than max row at least <laughs> he has better skills 100 wow look how much power we got 35 morale to everybody let's hope we can destroy them amplify the stacks please and do this thing actually you know what no I want to do the opposite Do this and then amplify the stacks. Actually, I don't know. I want to see if uh, if the terrorized gonna retain up to here. So nature to the front, I said, and nice. Nature and nice, the only thing that matters. Okay, you go to the front. And you go to the back, to the middle. And now I should use a mecha. Is this a demon? Should I go all in with this power thing? Yeah, let's go all in with this power thing. So you you are gonna tank. I mean, everybody's gonna die anyway, so... Might as well get a bunch of damage out. And hope that Kimberley destroys them with the, the power amplification. Tanking one or more times isn't gonna... Uh-oh. I'm stupid. Ooh, look at this. Look at this thing. Can I destroy the back line? Is this guy even gonna survive? He's attacking last. And he's gonna take a hit from... 56 nature... This guy's dead. I think I should go for the damage though. Yeah, if I can remove the back line. No! <laughs> oh man.
When did I stop reading abilities? One, two. When did I stop reading abilities? When did I become such a bad player? We still got this though, but easy target. Let's go. Can you amplify, freeze? No, it, it was not fast enough to amplify it. But still, these guys got easy armor, so backline. Backline again. Can you please die? Can you please die, man? This is gonna bounce up to the end. Bye. I'm so disappointed in myself that I failed to read the abilities. <laughs> Everybody's dead. The Naga died first, even. Wow, I played this so bad. I had this easily. I mean, I'm not gonna lose, but... I will lose a bunch of HP for no reason. Actually, I might lose. Yeah, I'm saying I'm not gonna lose, but I might actually lose. I don't... I'm not full HP here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You say that, but can we win? 55. At least we are getting a bunch of... Uh-oh. This thing is gonna kill us. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Okay, we're not gonna die, but this I played this so bad. I played this so, so, so bad. Okay, now we... Yeah. Okay, silence. Yeah, I'm gonna take the silence. 30 morale and silence. Yeah, for sure. Give me this thing. Oof, oof, oof. That's swapping in the beginning. That destroyed us. And then the Naga in the back, although she was my best unit. That also was very bad. I think I should go for the doctor, but <laughs> I want to go to the trainer. Nah, let's go for the doctor. Let's not risk that much. Let's go for the event. Ooh, you want this? Forget it. What are you giving me? Mechas gain 20% of maximum life as bear points when attacking at least. Uh, this is free, right? I mean, I'm gonna use most of the time only one mecha, but... Might as well. Workshop, obviously. Uh, three ammunition. Three ammunition is better. Let's see what we got here. Artifact and a disaster room. This should be easily doable. The other choice would be... Should I just go for a monster? Yeah, I think I want to go for the easy fight. And let the Enigmatic Shadow relax. Actually, no, no, no. I'm gonna go for the easy fight, but I'm not gonna let anybody relax. Yeah, let's get the monster here. <laughs> wow. A swap -aroo. Okay, gotta remember it. Of course, the traps after the swap. So, ice front and physical front. Twenty and twenty-five is forty-five. Thirty-five, thirty-five is fifty. So this guy's better. Or ice and physical the front, um, and also oh he has a bit less HP though. Ice is more important than fight. Yeah, let's go for him. Let's hope he gets swapped as front as as to front as possible. And then I will just take the rest of the team and hope for the best. I want to keep Enigmatic Shadow alive, so he's gonna be in the middle, and you're gonna be here. And 50-50, Krieger Blue either dies or goes to the back, and we win. Let's hope he goes to the back and we win. Amplify the traps, the stacks. They are gonna get stacks of something at least. And ice and physical to front. It's the same unit as the other team here. And then, like last time, I'm gonna pick the skeleton just so that I have the 30% the damage on, on the other two units. And here... Use spider, come on. Not everybody's gonna be alive, I mean... Swap me good. Perfect, perfect, perfect. We got what we wanted. Okay, can you remove... Okay, you are gonna die. Um, you know what? 
What do you do? Nature to everybody. Yeah, let's give him tiredness so he doesn't damage us. 30, 26. Oh, frontline's dead. <laughs> Kaboom. <laughs> uh, kill the backline, please. Thank you. This unit is overpowered. Ooh, look at this thing. Bye bye. Bye bye, my unit. Ooh, he sh she survived. Nice, very nice. Yeah, I don't care. Middle's toast. Middle still toast. Yep, bye middle. Wee wee wee. Fifty percent increased damage. Uh, one to the back. One to the front. And one to the middle. And when I say middle and front, I mean front and middle, obviously. <laughs> A naga. And arrow. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. One. Bye. Wow. When he attacks, he's like, Hur! and when he runs, he's like, wah, wah, wah. <laughs> so fire and burn to everybody. This I I really love this unit, but not on this run. Here the air damage, thirty morale, and applies bound five. Ooh, applies enchant trap and enhanced enhanced trap to the next trap, and the skeleton's kind is defeated. I think I will go for the doggo. Yeah, I will go for the doggo. Because uh, he does morale damage to everybody and also he gives the guaranteed crit. Yeah, I'll go for the doggo. For the for the for the for the backline team. Okay, we will go to the trainer. Let's first name the doggo. The doggo's name is Dima the other one I don't know how to read. Nibko? I don't even know. I don't know how this is read. So you go to the back team just to have a better skeleton here. I think I want to see whatever the next fight is. Let's go for trainer, siege, and then plunder, I think. Trainer is gonna be the doggo gets this skill upgraded. Ooh, the Naga. I think I will go for the Naga. Yeah, 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 let's go for the Naga. And, uh... Pierre? I mean, I'm using this unit, so yeah, let's go for Pierre. The reason I'm going for Pierre, not Butters, is because there's a high chance I will let Butters relax in the next run. Uh, I, w I said Siege, but if I go Plunder twice, there is a high chance I got some motivation event. So let's go for the Plunder and hope for some kind of motivation event here. Yeah, three motivation, but one guy is gonna not be in the fight. I really like this and hope for Serenix. If Enigmatic Shadow is off, we got a problem. Monster, find a monster. Three, but all of them are gonna be off for one day. I don't think one... This is a really good one, actually. Pretty trap. I think this is really good. Two weeks. One motivation. Uh, Enigmatic Shadow still won't be max. While here he will be maxed out. Now let's go for this. I also get a free monster and 100 gold. Yeah, that's really good. Nice. I found another one of those units. Very nice. And they will be back even in time. So uh, This unit is extremely strong. The one I got. This Birokas. So let's have him in the back line. And now we can even swap him out with Krieger Blue when he gets to level 2. Let's go for the plunder for the same reason I went before. Nice. Uh, Thirty-five percent to injury somebody. Uh, we got good choices for injuries. I like this amount of money. Hundred percent somebody is not gonna be in the next fight. If it hits the Naga, we got a problem. Naga, Kimberley, definitely not this one. The enrage is nice. Uh, this thing is also nice. Gold set monster free. I will go for the gold. I can let the butter so relax. Please don't hit anybody. Yes, it didn't hit anybody. Very, very, very nice. Off to the event. Wait. To all of master resistances. Bidokas. Send Bidokas for 10 resistance to the master. To master. Uh, I will refuse, I think. Yeah, I will refuse. Uh, I can let others relax here come to the front these two are gonna fight and hopefully survive 
this gives morale back. This removes debuffs. I think I can do this thing for the master bonus. Otherwise, I can try to get another good trap on an easier fight. I think I should go for the easier fight and let these two relax. Yeah, I can let these two relax. Bring Bidokas to the front. I have the dream team in the back anyway. Do I? What's the dream team? Uh, It's the doggo and... what? What is the dream team supposed to be? Definitely not this thing. I don't have a mecha. Ah, I'm missing uh, butters for the dream team. Yeah, I cannot have everybody relax here. Mm. Oh, you know what? This guy comes to the front. And a mecha, this guy goes to the back. Now we got the dream team. And the front's gonna be just a damage team. A damage sponge. Whatever. Yeah, let's uh, let's try this thing. And from the next fight on, let's go to the adventures here. Get a trap, get some money. Let's, let's do an easy fight. I don't think we're gonna lose in a level 2 fight. Morale was reduced. Okay. That yeah, just checks. These ice damage can't be affected by penalties. Morale and time. Damage and morale taken from traps. Okay, this is not gonna be an easy fight. So, air to the front. Air and fire to the front. Air and fire to the front. It is actually Mike Rutsburns. Believe it or not. And then, uh, ice the back is... Axtero? I don't see us surviving this thing. Okay, this team is most likely dead. So, amplify all the debuffs, I think, yes. Because uh, they are they are gonna be poisoned or something. The backline's not, obviously, but... Balance dealing damage or morale over time. Okay, this guy's not gonna be affected by anything, but the rest are, so... And now the quote-unquote dream team. I, uh, air. Air and fire to the front. Does this team have air and fire? I think. Kimberley is air and fire. Yeah, it is Kimberley. Wow, my best unit is air and fire. Give him some resistance with a doggo. And um, ice to the back is gonna be here. So we got the dream team, as I said. Hopefully, the Naga is gonna survive the hits. One can only hope. Uh, I guess let's get the spider. Okay, this guy's dead instantly. Wow. Uh, can I even attack the backline with other units? No, let's go for the toxic arrow. Front line. I can't choose anything else. Yep, front's dead. Let's go for... Oh, he's buffed. Yeah, remove the buff. Nice, he's alive still. If I do even minimal damage to the front line, it's gonna be success. I'm really... Oh, I'm really afraid I'm gonna lose. Can this guy survive even? Yeah, he cannot. They don't even have debuffs. Okay, I have to do I have to do something here. Barrier to the next team. I'm really afraid I'm gonna use I'll lose. Can I kill the front line? 78 air damage. When is this bouncing? Ah, this is gonna bounce. Wait, I can kill the front line. At least, if I kill the front line, at least something's gonna happen. You can be there. You start to tank the back line. Maybe there's a high chance he got this. Okay, you bite. And then now the Naga's gonna bounce. Yeah, yeah, we got this. We got this, we got this. Naga survive one hit? No. It's okay though. This should start damaging the backline heavily. 
Yeah, front line's gonna go down from the bleeds. Kimidera. Whoa. Whoa. Oh. Front line's dead. Back line's dead. One. Bye. Front line bye. Nice. And yeah, now you start taking hits. Pop. Pop. And you can no longer defeat me. Pop. Pop. We won. That is the power of 30% more power. Nice, 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 nice. 20 morale and enhanced trap on the next trap. I think I will go for this. 40% damage applies burn, not really. The barrier is okay, but we are morale focused. Merchant or doctor? And after that, most likely business trip. I think I will go for the merchant business trip event or merchant plunder event. Something along those lines. Bring the dream team back to the front, please. Come over here, Mike Bachurans. Go relax, my bro. You can go back to help out. The rest is okay. So, I will go for the merchant. We can find something good here. We find another Skeledog. What is this guy? Physical. Uh, fire and morale to everybody. This is nice. Gains dodge at the start of the fight. This is also nice. Physical implies vulnerable. This is also very good. The other choice would be the doggo. Nah, let's go for this. Yeah, let's take this. Let's go. Time another name. And this guy is Zoro Uno. Zoro Uno. There is no chance I'm not using Enigmatic Shadow in the middle, in the front. So let's just bring him to the back. He might have all help out. You can relax, my friend. The front line is very fixed about what's gonna be. I have all the resistances, right? Maybe not armor. Oh, you know what? Pierre comes to the front. Barrios go to the back. Actually... Mm, no, 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 no. Let's have Barrios in the front and Pierre in the back. Yeah, I'm pretty covered on everything other than armor, but... I mean, do the enemies ever have armor damage? <laughs> uh, it's a joke, they do. But I don't have any better choice anyway, so... This is the team. I don't care. Let's go off to a business trip for a bunch of resources. We have so many units. This is the level 2 unit. What is this? Heroes? No. Bye bye level 2 unit. See you in the next fight. Uh, event. What is this? One of your employees could help you lower the price plus one level. Mm, yes. So when a monster offers you a surface in exchange for one of your employees. These two are gonna get a level. Please tell me that's it. Yeah, that was it. Wow, awesome, awesome, awesome. What an awesome event. Let's go on for the events. It's three. Mechas gain taste two at the start of the turn if they have barrier points. Uh, do I ever have barrier on my mechas? No. Let's get the gold. Only the second. Uh, and I don't even use th that many mechas. Okay, so the resting room is morale gain. And it's extremely dangerous. It might even kill us. This resting room is health gain. Let's go for this. Dodging the hard fights. Okay. Swaparu? Yeah. What about silence? <laughs> Tell me about it. Ice? That's it. Ice only. Ice to the front. Barus, come over here. Ooh, Hedalus is back. Hey, Hedalus. <laughs> Welcome to the team, man. <laughs> Where were you? How was the business trip? Nice and relaxing. Plies on the mental weakness when attacking. No. <laughs> Well, Butter's gonna die in two hits, but whatever. Nature and fire. Do I even care what they do? I think I don't. Enigmatic Shadow lasts because he's the strongest unit in the team. I think. I think he's the strongest unit in the team. And Krieger Blue in the back. Can't be affected by Demoralize. Attacks regenerate. Life. Okay. Uh, yeah, Enigmatic Shadow. I, th I, I want Enigmatic Shadow last for sure. 117 fight. Wow. I think I can kill the front line even. Uh, amplify the stacks that enemies will already have. And uh, ice to the front, as I said. Uh, the Naga is the ice to the front. 
and then the doggo is gonna be the skeleton of the team and Pierre is gonna be the burn team. Yeah, the mech of the team. So let's go. <laughs> the monkey trap. Monkey trap, let's go. Everybody has low air resistance, so straight up, let's go. Let's go for the front guy, right? Yeah, I want to kill the front guy as fast as possible. I mean, the other choice is going to be to just damage whoever has the lowest air resistance. Let's go the front, come on. Nice, it even hit the back. The reason I'm going for the front is because I want to kill him very quickly. Okay, now his motivation is even lower than the hell than, than max. Yeah, I'm going to I'm killing the front guy. Wow. Bye bye. Yishi. Everybody's dying. He's not even going to attack. <laughs> well, he's dying from burn, so Let's start damaging the, the next person. Yeah, let's do this for the middle guy. Please die. Thank you. Uh, let's damage the front a bunch. Is there a reason for that even? I don't even think there is a reason to damage him because the the back line is full on morale build. Oh no, uh Thomas physical. Yeah, let's go for the fire call. The reason for that is that the doggo is gonna kill this guy. I know that they are gonna heal, but um barrier to the team, I guess. Maybe I should have poisoned them. Ah whatever. Yep, the dog is gonna kill the front line for sure. Yeah, look at this. It was a good idea. Uh, yeah, Naga. Overpowered as always. Yeah, yeah, you you do you. <laughs> you do you. Bye bye. Are you gonna die from health or from scared? Almost died from health. Almost died from health loss. Uh, I really don't like any of these units. Uh, they are level 3, right? Ooh, they are level 3, though. Mecha. I could use this guy to spam the shielding. Uh, I'm already very covered on... Yeah, I will, I will take this guy to spam the shielding. The other choice would be to go this, for the Succubus in case of the event. Just for the event, though. I don't need the Succubus for anything else. Now let's go for the mecha to spam the shielding if need be. I think mecha is the most uh, engineering. No, let's go for the workout. And then sheets, workout sheets, siege event. Let's name the mecha. The mecha is the leg slapper. Let's go for the workout. I won't be buying traps, forget that. I hate it, I hate it. Let's get this though. I'm not getting max HP. I, I'm not even gonna be at max HP. Let's go to she Siege, get some gold here for free. Let's send off this trap, which I think is the worst of the ones we have. Uh, black Market, I won't be going. What did we find? Can I? I don't even remember what this thing does. 30 blood for a skeleton. Enigmatic Shadow is my skeleton. <laughs> uh, let's uh, let's buy it, I guess, and call it a uh, Proclalypse. He does also moral damage and demoralize. He's okay. He is not Enigmatic Shadow, but he's still okay. He does his job. Workshop, obviously. Plays their weakness, forget it. More damage and more morale damage. Trainer for sure. Is everybody back? Uh, do I even want to upgrade these guys? Enigmatic Shadow I will not need. Kimberly I will also not need. So let's have them here just in case we might upgrade them. And let's go to the upgrade guy. 
So, can you upgrade them? Upgrade guy. What can you give me? Make this thing better. I like it. Make this thing better and give him power. And gain stem power and 5 resistance for hero effect by frostbite. This is never gonna happen. Idolus, a bunch of defenses. He's a demon. What's what's the demon I'm using? It's Krieger Blue. Oh, I want to upgrade Bidocast first of all, because I want to have a second Krieger Blue. Uh, I don't need these guys. I think I will go for Hadalus here for the defenses. Procalypse. Power, Ice, Morale. This is going to become 3 demoralized for sure. I will put him in the back so that I have a choice instead of the dog. Let's go for the dog for this passive. Uh, Serenix I'm not using at all. Pierre, I should upgrade Pierre and Butters. Again, Pierre first because I'm going to use him more. And I'm out of uh, blood. So I can only upgrade level 2 units. Uh, let's do this. There is a very good chance that this thing is going to do demoralized. It does demoralized. Very nice. Event. Give me something good. Nice. We got 10 free. Uh, collectors are going to cost me life. Uh, yeah, let's do it. Off you go. Business trip for whatever. I have so many units right now. Uh, monster 20% Collectors 5 with 20 damage on morale. Eh. Eh. Yeah. Wow, we are going to use one of my good units no matter what I do. Let's end off butters for the higher amount of resources. I'm not sending off Kimberley, forget that. This should be the fight before the last one. I will. Okay, let's set up the team before I press any buttons here and lose the run. You go here, I don't need you anymore, like, at all. That's the front mega team. Um, I... I can send... Yeah, Serenix? I don't need Serenix. What's the nature block in the back? Bidokas is the nature back. I'm, I'm gonna be using Bidokas most of the time, but... Uh, let's have Hedos in, in, in any case. In case something goes completely wrong. Do I have a mecha in the front team? I don't even have a mecha in the front team. Pierre, come to the front main. And then I won't have a mecha in the back team. Pierre's... Need the back team is one, two, three. Most of the time, these three. And the front team is gonna be one, two... Oh, where's Kimberley? What? Yeah, Kimberley, come over here. I just come to the front. Maxro come to the front for the mecha slot. I don't have a mecha in the front. This is gonna be used in the back 100% of the time. I don't have any more mechas. I need mechas. And let's go fight this thing over here. Yeah, this should be easy. Master bonus gold. I have a disaster with me. Let's go. Yeah. Mwohohoho. <laughs> Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> Let's go for enhanced trap. Does he even have a trap? Removes the penalty with the most stacks, dodges the activation. Can be affected. I don't even know. I will just go for these two, so let's uh, let's let's start with the uh, non technician, I guess. Who cares? Really, 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 who cares? So, ice to the front and fire to the front. Ice and fire is the worst thing that can combine that can happen. I don't even know if that resistances exist. I don't know if ice and fire resistant exists in a monster. Uh, well, gotta use what I said I'm gonna use. So, ice and fire. You got the fire down. What's the most of those two? The most is the ice part, so... This guy is plus 25%. This guy is plus 15%. But he has mostly the ice part, which is more important. Now, let's... Uh, let's, probably, let's, let's go do this. So that I can use the ability that gives barrier to everybody. And then, uh, as always, Enigmatic Shadow in the very back. No, what am I even talking about? Ice, ice, ice resistance. <laughs> so that would be Krieger Blue. And I'm in the middle. This this is gonna go 
completely bad for sure. This is not gonna go well. Now let's do the silence. Now let's do ice and fire. Does this team has the ice? Ooh, there's an ice and fire resistant guy. Ooh, Kiwi. Yeah, come over here. Kimberley, come over here. And then the doggo, the mega doggo. And then uh, for the. We got the demon, right? Now we just need the mecha. I forgot the ice in the back. Which happens to be Pierre. <laughs> Man. Morale and haste. I will go for the morale and haste and hope for the best. Everything's leveled up. Yeah, let's go for the morale. We are going for the morale here. Okay, she's alive. He's alive. Help the team. Help the team. You can die a hero, man. No. Okay, you can survive one more hit. Damage him. He got a bunch of barrier. Of course. That guy. Ooh. He's alive. Yes. Continue the morale damage. Hinky me there, Babu Bam, everything's dead. Uh, easy targets, I think. Yeah, easy targets. Traps are coming up. This thing got the enhanced trap. Does everybody have reduced air? The back line. What? Look how much damage he's getting. Hit four. Yep. Pio. 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 This trap did something. <laughs> you guys are so toast. Uh, damage everybody, please. Kill the backline. I don't want to deal with this guy. Yep, I don't want to deal with him. The front line's afraid. Uh, yeah, hit them both. Actually, remove the backline, please. Bye bye and bye bye. Easy, and we even got 10 as well. I like this. I like this. Um, max life, forget it. No, let's go for this. And now we are ready for the final fight. It doesn't matter what my motivation is on the units. So, I even got a seminar coming up. Uh, let's bring the level 2 units up for the level. Pierre, you can relax. Let's see who levels up here. And then we are off. So, I think I will go for the leg snapper for the health and the resistance. Zoro is also very nice. Do I have enough for both? I do not have enough for both. I can only upgrade one unit. The choice would be a Ap Apocalypse I'm not gonna use. Okay. So, I think I will go for Bidokas or the demon in the backline? No, the demon in the backline is gonna be Kimberley no matter what. And the skeleton in the back line is going to be the doggo. The skeleton in the front line is going to be enigmatic shadow. Um, so I will go for the leg snapper for the mecha of the front team. And that's going to be it. I can upgrade these. They are pretty much free. So let's upgrade. Uh, I'm not going to use this guy. Let's upgrade this. He, he is the only guy that has a chance to be used. A chance. And when I say a chance, I mean like almost zero. But... <laughs> So things not gonna be used, I'm sorry. Butter's not gonna be back for the fight. So this is my backline team. Yeah. Let's go for the seminar. This is the only thing we can do. Yeah, let's get resistances. I mean that was was that was gonna be my choice anyway. Event something good, please. Wow. Such good event, man. Such good event. Give me the gold. This is uh, the last fight anyway. Uh, let's go for the event. We might find something useful. It doesn't matter. Yeah, permit. Do whatever you want, man. <laughs> it's yours. <laughs> it's yours, Dima. 
So the front team is one, two, three most likely. Very high chance for this guy. And the second team is one, two, three. Guaranteed. Yep, that's it. Let's go. And they have the buff removal. Uh, I don't care about Enigmatic Shadow. You you carried us, man. Enigmatic Shadow, you carried us. <laughs> I really like this uh, new playstyle I'm adopting with only going for... Uh, not only, with, uh, with going for a bunch of units and have the utility to choose what I want. Air to the front and nice to the back. So... Ice to the back. Air to the front is gonna be Krieger Blue, I think. And Ice to the back is gonna be Enigmatic Shadow? What? Okay, Air to the f Ooh, I cannot use Leg Snapper. Air to the front is gonna be Max Zero. Yes. And Ice to the back. Yeah, how much is the Ice damage? It's 100. This applies vulnerable though. Okay, and Ice to the back is gonna be Krieger Blue and he's gonna survive pretty much one hit. No matter who I put in the back, he's gonna survive one hit. If I put Krieger Blue in the front, he's gonna take 87 uh, halved, which is gonna be about 40, and then another 40, and he's gonna go down. While Max Zero is gonna survive the hits here, so it's it's gotta be like that. I don't have a choice, really. Yeah, I don't think I have a choice. I can use Leg Snapper for nothing. He's neither air nor ice, so this guy's out. I have to use Max Zero here for their resistance to the front. I know she has 60%, but if you think about it, she's gonna get f hit for about 30 from this, and then about 35 from this, 40 for this, and then this next 40 hits gonna kill her for sure. She just has 100 HP. So it's better, uh, while the Golem in the back is gonna definitely be ice. How much? 20 ice, he's gonna get hit for 70 and 70. It doesn't matter. It's the same thing. There's no difference here. Yeah, it's the same thing. I, I only want her to attack even once and she's gonna attack twice. So that's enough for me. These three are gonna be... They cannot kill her in, in, in one round, right? 135 is definitely not killing her. So she's gonna take 75 from the ice. And then from the fire she's gonna take more than 35. Ooh, she's gonna die instantly. Yeah, no, 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 that was wrong. I miscalculated. She can survive in the front, while in the back she cannot. In the front she's gonna take... Yeah, she's gonna survive in the front at least one more round, so that's what I'm going for. Almost make a grave mistake there. They don't have Swaparoo, right? Yeah, they don't have Swaparoo. So... Let's go for the damage amplification on the upcoming trap, right? I think yes. The other choice would be to amplify the debuffs they have. I mean, what am I gonna use here, right? <laughs> and yeah. Yep, yep. And then I'm gonna go for the classic theme. I sorry for the for me being lost in thoughts, but I I have to play this correctly here. In the air to the front is gonna be Pierre, right? Yeah. Yeah. Kimberly, please survive. I think she can survive. With 45 ice series, yeah, she can survive. The last drop, ah, eh, might as well be the silence. In case anything goes completely haywire. Okay, the first thing that has to happen is the backlines got to get feared away. Yeah, I need to fear the backline out. I'm not sure I can do it, but I will try my best. Okay. Next round, front line's gonna die. Okay, let's remove the buff from the enemy front line, obviously. Oh, we got some barrier here. Yeah, maybe we can even survive. No, 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 she's dead. I tried my best. Uh, This nice this 
I should have went with the uh, stacks with the amplification of buffs trap here in the front. For sure, look how many debuffs they have. Oh, I survived. Awesome. Yeah, the backline's gonna die. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Backline's toast. Look at this. Minus 65 air resist. Bye bye, backline. Run. Run, Achna. Run. Achna. Bye bye. And she cannot revive it also, so that's another upside of morale builds. Uh, it really doesn't matter. <laughs> it really doesn't matter. Let's go for the morale. Wee -wee 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 -wee. And now the dream team is here. Ow. Nega power. Bye bye. How did you get stunned and leave? Bye bye bye. Bye 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 bye. Victory. Well, you were protecting our rear. We found the culprits and imposed the appropriate disciplinary action for their unauthorized experiments on you. I'm sending you their research and the skeletons of the lab workers behind this fraudulent operation. They'll be a great first line of defense against the oncoming champions. <laughs> it's it's really funny that they use death and so on for uh, things like this. Like, I'm gonna send you the skeletons of the lab workers. <laughs> like, we killed them and then we revived them as skeletons and now they are the warriors. You can use them to throw them into the pits. <laughs> that was easy. I know. Let's go. We got another level. So many ideas. So many ideas. Um, okay, that's the next run for anybody that wants to, uh, I guess, make some ideas. The next run is gonna be this one. So I'm gonna be again playing the engineer just to complete every single uh, boss, I guess. But uh, yeah, other than that, that is it. Uh, heads up, I got a Nexus GG account, so you could uh, help me by buying the game from there if you are also interested in playing the game, because if I remember correctly, I am selling this game there. If you find it somewhere else cheaper, obviously you don't need to buy it from me, but if you find it in the same price, you could help me out by buying it from there. So I think it gives you even a Steam key, so you're not even missing out on that part. Anyway... Uh, that's it. If you like the video, drop a like, I guess. And if you would like to know when I will live stream, you have to subscribe to the channel to see the update on the YouTube channel because I'm streaming over here in on YouTube. Anyway, that's it for today. Thanks for watching and see you guys around.